channel if you are not subscribed go ahead pause the video really quick and subscribe and to my lovely subscribers you know my subscribers that keep on growing i may not have that much but you know they're growing in the process so i want to say thank you to you guys um so today's video is going to be all about my tattoos and piercings um what i'm not gonna like show you i'm gonna have to like insert pictures in the video somewhere but um so we're gonna start i'm gonna like start from my first tattoo to the last one and then pain level and stuff like that and then piercings and so on okay so as far as tattoos um I honestly don't even know how I was able to get my first tattoo because I thought that I was gonna be scared so I don't know what but I got my first tattoo when I was 18 um, my aunt took me for my birthday it was a birthday gift I went to go stay with her for the um, summer for a while me and my friend so she took me to go get a tattoo and she got her first tattoo as well which I was so excited it was funny to me but um this is my first tattoo I don't know if you guys can see it clearly I'm not sure to focus but there you go um it says blessed um i got this tattoo done at a shop in baltimore and this little baby this little baby was forty dollars um but you know i didn't have to pay for it It was a gift so thank you to my aunt um my very first tattoo it says blessed um i got blessed because i am blessed with everything that i have and with everything that I am, I am blessed, okay? I am blessed beyond measures. So that's why I wanted to get this. Um, my second tattoo. Oh, my second tattoo is on my back. I'll enter a picture right here. I did not get that one professionally done. I got some of my tattoos done in-house and then some at shops. So I don't want to see anybody comment in the comment section. Oh, you know, that you're not supposed to do this, da, 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 you know, the precautions. I know the precautions. I know everything. I was of age when I got these tattoos done. So I'm very aware. But, um, yeah, so back to the second tattoo. I have it on the loam. It's the lotus flower, the swirl, and the dots. Honestly, I'm not going to even lie to you. I'm... I try to read up on the meanings of things before I get them inked onto my body, which they will be there forever. But um, I really didn't have a, a true meaning to that tattoo. I got it because I thought it was cute, but that's what us girls do. We get things because they're cute. My third tattoo was down my spine. Um, it's in Arabic and it says, love yourself first um you guys may have seen that tattoo on um amor jada her instagram yeah everybody is getting the tattoos like her now but i thought that was cute so yeah i seen that and i was like i wanted that but um love yourself first it goes a long way before you can love anyone else and you know respect and care for anyone else you have to start putting yourself first and respecting yourself and doing things for yourself before others so that's like a cute little inspirational thing to me it's like i'm always telling myself aries love yourself first put yourself first respect yourself care for yourself you know keep yourself to the most the utmost highest respect you know do for yourself more so than you'll ever do for anyone else my fourth tattoo um the top of my back in roman numerals it is my birthday 0522 So since we're on my back tattoos, my spine, I'm not going to even lie to you, spine tattoos hurt, but you got to sit through it if you want it. Um, but I could just feel the needle going in and I could just feel the blood going down. But I mean, it wasn't that bad. Um, I'm probably making it sound bad, but you know, I have seven tattoos and I want more. So it's honestly not that bad. Tattoo number five, I have on the side of my rib. Um, my right rib, boob, whatever you want to say. I have a cross. I wanted that just because. Tattoo number six. You guys, I didn't even, honestly, I didn't even wait a whole year. It's like a time span in between my tattoos. I just kept getting them back to back to back to back to back. But you would honestly never think that I had all these tattoos, which is crazy. But number six. 
Number six, I have feathers on the side of my hip. I have two feathers. They were originally supposed to be bigger, but um, I just thought they were cute. I'm gonna go back and get some more work done to that. I want like my whole, I don't wanna say my whole leg, but I want like my whole left side of my body from my hip up to my back to be done. I'm still thinking on what else I wanna add to that. To number seven which I regret getting I regret getting it um I got this done this is an in-house tattoo now y'all when you go get your tattoos done make sure you see people's work that's as far as their penmanship their um their portrait stuff all of that okay so the guy he was really good he's probably gonna watch this video but I don't care but he's really good in like portraits you know drawing people things like that like his work is really good but I wanted this little quote on my side right trying to be fancy and it says what comes easy won't last and what lasts won't come easy and I know y'all probably like Aries why did you get that tattoo do you already it's in your mental you already know it. why would you get that tattoo on you cuz I thought I was being cute and I want something else on my back but I am gonna get it covered up I just don't know when but um, yeah, so I got it in cursive, and it was cute on paper, but when it got on me, I was like, what the f Like, what? I was like, maybe once it heals, it'll look better. I, mm -mm. like, it looks crooked. The penmanship is awful. It's not up to the best point that it should be. So that's gonna get covered ASAP. But yeah, I'm just going to show you guys all of my pictures. Like I said, when you get these tattoos done, you want to be mindful, you know, is the, um, the needles and the guns clean. That's what I make sure. When I go to in-house, um, when I get my in-house tattoos, I look at everything. I want to see you open the pack. I want to see you sanitize everything down. I don't care. I want to see everything it's because i don't play by my body you know i want to stay clean i don't want i know y'all probably seen that um i think it was a picture on twitter or instagram the girl where she got the rose right here or something like that and it started eating at her skin i was like that made my skin crawl i didn't want that to happen to me so you don't want that to happen to you you know take pride in your tattoos you know yeah those are all of my tattoos i have a total of seven tattoos and let me tell y'all i'm not done yet i want more um, I, as far as arms, like anything up here, I do not want to get anything on my arms yet because when I become a beautiful bride, I don't want anything on my arms. I want to be nice and pretty, arms free, but yeah, that's just me. Oh, piercings. Okay, so I cannot show you guys full blown pictures of one of my piercings, but, um, yeah, I'll just tell you what it is. You got common sense to figure it out. But, um, so y'all know I have my, um, my first hole, got that in both ears. Then I have my second hole. Then I have my cartilage, but I took the earring, but I barely even wore them. I got my cartilage, both of them right here, two right there. And then on this side, um, what did I get? I got my cartilage and then something else on the top. I can't think of the name of it, but I got that pierced. I don't even wear them. It's like some some of the piercings that I get, I don't even wear them, but it depends. But yeah, and I got this, my nose. Y'all can see that. I got my nose pierced when I was, I think I was 17. I turned 17. The nose piercing, it hurt. It didn't hurt really bad. You know, everybody that gets it pierced, you're going to just, it's not like a little baby tear that's going to fall down, but that's nothing. But I would have to say my piercings hurt worse than tattoos. They did. I got my I bottom the bottom to my belly button pierce. I got that pierced last year with me and my friends. We had went to get a piercing. That hurt. Okay. Um, and then recently for my 19th birthday, don't even ask me why, because I still to this day don't even know why I got it pierced. But I got my nipples pierced. I'm not gonna show you what that looks like. You guys should already know. It's a nipple with the barbell through it. 
there you go but that hurt like crap oh my goodness but now it's like they hurt every now and then but that hurt like crap and mind you i got this done in may and we're now in november november 1st and it still hurts just a little but um yeah that's all of my tattoos and piercing as far as piercings i do not want any more piercings but as far as tattoos keep it coming i'm gonna figure it out i might just take you guys on a journey with me when i get another tattoo we'll see but i thank you guys for watching today's video and i hope you like it remember if you are not subscribed to my channel make sure you go ahead and pause the video really quick or you know just wait till you're done watching it and subscribe click the bell for notifications so you can figure out when i'm posting you know it'll pop on your phone computer whatever um follow me on all social media sites at instagram b-a-d-g-a-l underscore a-i-r-i and that is bad gal underscore airy snapchat is the same thing and if you guys didn't catch that don't worry i'll put everything in the description bar below but thank you guys for this video i'm sorry if it was too long and i will see you guys in the next video